And we are back here on UFC Ultimate Insider, presented by Harley Davidson. Back in 2007, the son of a Japanese karate master hailing from Brazil made his octagon debut. And he has since made an indelible mark on the light heavyweight division. Employing a unique fighting style, he went on to become a UFC champion, along the way producing some of the most iconic finishes the UFC has ever seen. Now for a look back at Lyoto Machida's most seminal moments, we present the timeline of the Dragon. I'm Lyoto Machida, this is my timeline. My first fight in UFC, it was in UFC 67, 2007. My opponent was uh, Sam Hoger. My first fight in Vegas, it was a dream for me. My main main goal was the win. If it was submission, if it was knockout, it doesn't matter for me. Boom! I just I just wanted to win the fight. As expected, it's Machida by unanimous decision. UFC 790, I fought Sokuju. Sokuju! I was on the dog that fight. Everybody talking about the Sokuju. Sokuju is one of the best fights in the world. You almost want to just sit back and watch Sokuju and soak it in. But I kept my focus and escaped from him. When I saw his stepping, I threw my punch and I hit in his chin and he, he fell. Sokuju got caught and now Machida trying to take advantage. And when I, when I threw my elbows in his face, I fell. Oh, now at the time I I get my Katagatami. And he's out now. Oh, he's got it. He's got it. He's seconds seconds on the side. Plenty of time. Salted juice going to slam. And that is all over. Leona Machida remains unbeaten. I fought Thiago Silva, UFC 94, January 2009. Thiago Silva! Thiago Silva is a very aggressive fighter, and I'm, I'm opposed to him. You want to touch it up, do it, now go back to your corner. Let's go. When the fight started, Thiago Silva comes like a crazy guy, you know? But I, every time when I hit him, I put him on the ground. Yeah, but... Maybe two, two or three seconds at the end of the rounds, I hit his face, and the fight was over. He throws at you. UFC 98, when I fought against Rashai Evans, and it was a dream for me. I knew that I could get the belt. I just had to control the fight, and I was waiting for the, the time, the right time. He, he opened the window for me, I threw a lot of punch, and never stopped. I just stopped when I knocked him out. He's done it! He's out! It's all over! He's out! Leona Machida! And then now I put the belt around my waist. I finally get my dream and I become a UFC light heavyweight champion. UFC 129, I fought Randy Couture. Couture! He tried all the time to get my leg, to take me down. And I, I saw the moment and I did a big kick with a jump kick. It's a very famous kick in Karate Kid movie from Daniel San. That is the Karate Kid. That fight from Randy Couture, you know, I was very emotional because I was part of his life, I was part of the history. It was a very important for my career. Machida said, I don't think karate was ever gone, and he proved it tonight. I fought Ryan Bader in UFC on Fox in my new home, Los Angeles. You can see that Ryan Bader, he maybe got a panic. He ran against me and I hit his face. Just one punch and fight is over. When you rush Leona Machida, it's like walking into a wood chipper and boom, this fight is over. <laughs> the crowd was crazy. Everybody screamed my name, big victory in my new home. The driver's back! My next fight is against the Munoz, 
he's a great friend, but everybody want to be champion, and I'm not different. For me, it's a midweight debut. My first fight in, in this class, a new moment for me, and I want to be champion in this class too.